Hello, boys and girls. This is Aunt Fernita. Today's lesson is called the right choice. Today's memory verse is from Matthew chapter three, verse seventeen. It says, "This is my son, whom I love. With him I am well pleased." The message is, "I tell others I belong to God's family." When I choose to be baptized, Sarah, a young missionary child, lived in Russia. Even though she was small, she begged to be baptized. So she studied the Bible with her parents every day. Finally, the big day came. Sarah and some friends were baptized in a cool Russian river on a sunny Sabbath afternoon. Some people who did not know Jesus watched. They listened to the singing. They heard the prayers. They were curious. That day, Sarah and her friends told some strangers about God's family. How? Sarah chose to be baptized. A long time ago, someone else told others about God's family when he chose to be baptized. The hot noonday sun sparkled on the river as the people listened to John's powerful words. Repent," he told them. "God's kingdom is close. Turn from your sins and be baptized. Let God know that you choose to follow Him." Many people came to hear the preacher by the river. Some came because they really did want to give their lives to God. Others were just curious. John was a no-nonsense kind of preacher. He wore simple clothes. Ate simple food and preached a simple message. One day, John was surprised and pleased to see Jesus making his way toward the river. He knew all about Jesus. For months, he had been telling people to get ready for the Messiah to come, and now he was here. John, I have come to be baptized. Jesus spoke softly. John was so surprised he could hardly talk. What me baptize you? Oh, 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 Jesus! You need to baptize me. I should not baptize you. Jesus smiled. John, baptize me as you have baptized others. It is the right thing to do. John smiled. Then, of course, I will. Jesus slowly walked into the water. John followed. He smiled at Jesus, then looked at the crowd. John took hold of his hands and gently laid Jesus back under the water. When Jesus came up out of the water, he knelt beside the river bank. Jesus knew that sin had made the people's hearts hard. He knew that many of them wouldn't understand his mission of love, so he talked to his father about it. Suddenly, Jesus was surrounded by beautiful light, straight from God's throne. He looked up. The Holy Spirit, in the form of a lovely dove, came down on Jesus. Then God's glorious voice rang out, "This is my beloved Son, whom I love. With him I am well pleased." Many people watched Jesus being baptized in the Jordan River that day. They saw the light from heaven surrounding him. That wonderful day made their faith grow. When Jesus was baptized, he didn't have any sin to wash away. He was baptized as an example for us. Every day, you can spend time getting to know Jesus better. You can thank him that you are a part of his family, and you can choose to follow his example some day soon. Baptism is a special time when we show everyone that we have given our lives completely to Jesus. God is so happy that we choose to be part of his family. He says, "You are my child, whom I love." I am so pleased with you.